The last, last McCurran Fergus. Yeah. <laughs> what is happening, Sarasota? I mean, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> I've never wanted to touch my fucking face so bad in my entire life. <laughs> I have so many holes in my head and I want to touch all of them. <laughs> Sir, can I touch your face for a bit just to feel a face? Come on, let me just scent of a woman it. Just touch your face for a second. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy, it's crazy. Apparently nobody's fucking had toilet paper. Now they're all Mad Max fighting for it. Like it's the last drop of water after the apocalypse. Did people not wash their hands and wipe their ass two weeks ago? People walking around dirty hand, filthy fucking asshole. Just... Pinching off apparently perfectly clean shits. No need to wipe. No need to even wash our hands. No hand sanitizer. You have hands? We, no, we don't have hand sanitizer, sir. We're sold out. Gotta make fucking ghetto hand sanitizer. Just get a sponge and some Jim Beam and carry that around. And wipe my hands off from time to time. It is crazy. It is crazy. There is, I, also, you know what? Apparently every business I've ever given my email to is now taking it upon themselves to let me know how they're dealing with the coronavirus. I'm like, you know what, Applebee's? I don't give a fuck what you're doing. Here at Domino's Pizza, we want you to know You're, we're no longer letting the delivery guys sneeze on the pizza before they bring it to you. Thanks for the update. My bank's like, is there anything we can do? I'm like, how about fucking not charging me anything for a month? They're like, we can't do that, sir. We will also not sneeze on your pizza. Like, thanks, bank. <laughs> I'm so stressed out. I watched way too much news the last three days. That doesn't make you less stressed out. They're, almost, they're excited. I hate them. They look, they're like, they've all got like fucking boners of excitement. They're like, <laughs> you want to hear something else scary? I'm like, no. <laughs> There's no reassurance. Then the president comes on, and he's like, ah. <laughs> It's like the science teacher didn't show up for school. Now they're making the gym teacher teach calculus or something. He's like, ah. What do we do? Uh, you want to play dodgeball? Fuck! The Democrats, their two frontrunners are home pushing 80 years old. They could be taken out with a cough. What's happening? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Pick a running mate around 40, somebody healthy. Anybody. This is gonna be my running mate. He's recently had an organ transplant. And... But you guys are coming out and I appreciate that. I, had a, I got stuck in Washington on the way here, not Washington State. I got... I got stuck in D.C. And I was stuck, I was stuck there overnight. A bunch of locals, they came out. We went out drinking, and then they came to the show. I'm like, yeah. I was like, they weren't afraid. I had the one moment while I was traveling on this last flight. You can tell. People were, like, stressed out in the airport. And I, I took a big drink of water. And then I had that thing. You know when your body just forgets how to do something? You know what I mean? Like, you know when you, like, you poke yourself in the eye with a straw? Even though you've used the straw a million times, like, anyway, I was gonna have a drink now. Ah! Like, or a big one is sometimes your body just forgets how to swallow. 
It's like you get stuff in your mouth and your body's like, wait a second, I know I've done this a million times. <laughs> Do I send it to the belly or the lungs? <laughs> Fuck it, send it to the lungs. <laughs> and I had that, I took a drink and just went in my lungs and then now I'm like, you can't cough in an airport right now. <laughs> People will murder you. So now you're holding in a cough, just a cup full of water in your lungs, trying to hold in a cough. Some flight attendant thinks you're flirting with her. avoid germs. Gotta avoid germs. We're bad at avoiding germs. We're humans. We love germs. Everyone takes their phone to the toilet with them. We're not gonna survive. I, I hate germs, but I love Candy Crush, so I should take this germ transportation thing to the bathroom with me. And then as soon as I'm out of the bathroom, ring, ring, oh, hello? Hello! The day before I left, I was in a Walgreens. This is when I was trying to buy hand sanitizer and just settled for a sponge and Jim Beam. And I saw the pharmacist. She was hanging out there and a delivery person came in, like a Postmates delivery food person came in and delivered a bunch of hot wings to her for lunch. He's like, do you order hot wings? I'm like, those are for me. I'm like, you're eating hot wings at work in a pharmacy? You psycho? Finger foods? Mm, mm, mm. Saucy finger food? And she had those giant nails too. Yeah. Like, what are you doing? Those nails are so long, there's probably still SARS under them, for fuck's sake. What are you doing? <laughs> how do you wipe your ass? I always think that when I see those nails. How do you wipe your ass? I'm like, what do you do? What do you do?